what you let her in for. Get out now. What does she think's gonna happen? That I'm just gonna forget the last 18 years and believe she's actually changed? There's more chance of her brushing her teeth. Right, well, if she's not gonna get the message, I'll have to do something about it, won't I? <laughs> Thanks, Steve. Happy to help. Before you start, I wouldn't have brought you X round if I didn't have to. All right? Yeah, we uh, move things along. There's a uh, headmistress I'm trying to exonerate. I want a restraining order against my mum. I, I, I don't think that's a good idea. Why? Have you any idea on which Donna Marie's been harassing her? Uh, look, I've seen these kind of cases before. And I promise you, there'll be no coming back from it. Good. Look, I'm not her biggest fan, but she is your mum. I mean, in time, you might feel differently. Do you want to know what happens every time she rocks up here? Everything that's good in my life. Perry, Marnie, you two, this place, in a heartbeat. It's like I'm looking at it through a window. Like it's someone else's life. And I like the path that I'm on now. But every time she comes around, she drags me back to her path, the path with the terrible decisions and no mates and no place to live. She destroys everything she touches, so I'm not gonna let her anywhere near me, where I live, all the people that I love, end of. Look, that feeling that you have, not belonging, you're know, living someone else's life, it's called imposter syndrome. And you are by no means an imposter. So then why, after all this time, do I still feel like one? I don't fit into your world. Look, I'm not going to lie to you, Julian. Most days you're a nightmare. But you have brought colour into our lives. From the moment you arrived, you have brought warmth into our cold family. And you're right. You don't fit in our world. But we'd never want you to. Why would we? when all we want is to fit into yours. You don't mean that. I do. I really, really do. Thanks, James. I take it you still want the restraining order? Yeah. Can you, um, can you do me a favour, though? Can you tell Mum that it won't be forever? And that I still love her? Underneath the fancy suit, there's a heart of gold, James Nightingale. Maybe there is hope for you.